For the next several months, the Seattle Public Library is hosting three dozen or so classes for writers of all ages. The best part, too, they're free. It's so cool. The program is called Seattle Writes, and Andrea Goff from Seattle Public, Public Library is here to tell us more about it. Now, Andrea, are we talking like poetry, prose, uh, short story writing? Yes, yes, and yes. We cover everything. <laughs> Wonderful. Yeah, absolutely. And, yeah, writing too. So why do this kind of a workshop? Yeah, so, uh, you know, the library offers a lot of classes for mm -hmm. adult learners. We do computer classes, we do ESL classes, and we looked around the city and we realized that while we have a tremendously literary city and a lot of organizations that offer classes for writers, they all cost money. Mm -hmm. And that can be prohibitive to people who don't have um, that money to kind of experiment with. So we saw an opening and the Seattle Public Library Foundation has supported us in offering free classes for the writers of Seattle. Is it just going to be creative writing or is there any type, other forms, technical, uh, that you guys will be addressing? It's mostly creative writing. So we okay. cover nonfiction and fiction topics. So we'll have a memoir class, um, but it's pre predominantly around creative writing. I love Who do you yeah. get to teach these workshops? Writers, yeah. I'm assuming. Writers, well, we're super lucky, right? Because Seattle yeah. is rich in writers. So we have mostly uh, Seattle area published writers who have experience teaching classes. Mm. You know, so we've got Karen Finney Frock, Nancy Rawls, Peter Mountford, Brian McDonald. I mean, I could just go on and on and on. We're really lucky. Yeah, and it's yeah. not even just about how to write, but it's finding the time to write. Mm -hmm. Finding, yeah. I mean, for me at least, for reading and writing, it's about finding just a block of uninterrupted time. And it's, yep. it's not easy writing. You're That's an English right. Writer. No, and inspiration is a huge part mm -hmm. of it too. And sometimes yeah. you just feel so bland. Like, what do I have to say? But getting that help, yeah. getting an assignment even sometimes, yeah. really can just yeah. spark you off and get you so excited. Absolutely. So we have a class this time uh, with Beth Slattery called uh, Writing for Procrastinators. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Right? I think Perfect. we can all, we can yeah. all uh, identify with that. We also, with Hugo House, we partner to offer writing circles every month at three different locations. Oh, and so that's just a place, you know, you can put it on your calendar, you can go, you can sit in a room of writers, get that great energy. And if you're stuck, there's a facilitator who will give writing prompts, who will help kickstart you and get you going. Smart. Okay. Yeah. Uh, how can folks at home uh, get involved? Yeah, so we have our schedule up on our website, so spl.org slash Seattle Rights, or you can search for Seattle Rights in the online calendar. Uh, we kick off this Saturday, September 8th, so we can jump right in. Right, and 30 plus classes, yeah. so there's a lot for everybody, it there sounds is. like. Yeah, pretty much every weekend. All right, Andrea Goff, real quick, while I got you, you read yeah. so much, what's a good book? Give us a recommendation. <laughs> uh, you know, I am currently reading Jade City by Fonda Lee, okay. which is a kind of mix of urban fantasy, kung fu movie style. Oh, um, yes. Yeah, it's really fantastic. All right, you're yeah. really great with the book suggestion. Thank you. <laughs> Andrea Goff with Seattle Public Library, thank you.